Welcome to Aglova National Grassland. And this is why we came to the toadstools. These incredible geological formations. I think I ran into some big cat tracks. And uh, time to head into the Badlands of Nebraska. Man, it is coming down. I got in the car just in time. So right now we're on Toadstool Road. It's about 12 miles to get to the geological formations. It is a dirt road, a little washboardy at times, but for the most part, it's relatively packed down. I've heard if you try to come out here after a rainstorm, it might be a little bit tricky to get through without a four wheel drive vehicle. The scenery out here is really remote as well. On the right hand side, you'll be driving past grasslands. Left hand side, you have railroad tracks that receive pretty heavy use. So our hike is officially underway, and this is why we came to the toadstools. These incredible geological formations. Hope you enjoy this as much as I am. So here on the Great Plains Trail, it'd be very easy to get lost. I'm barely seeing any footprints, let alone a trail. But thankfully, every 100 yards or so, you got these guys, which define your route for you. This is so cool. Time to head into Badlands of Nebraska. So is this the Great Plains or what? You got ranching, you got grasslands, and you got the Badlands. Woo! So these grasslands were established in 1960. 150,000 square miles and 94,000 acres. So a house was built on this site back in 1924, and due to a lack of maintenance and weather, it was demolished. But in 1984, the US Forest Service built a replica of the house on the same location. This is a sod house. Out here on the grasslands, there's not a lot of resources available to you. Obviously very few trees. So they use sod to actually construct this structure. You know, what's really neat about it too is it's about 96 degrees outside, and inside this house, it's at least 15 degrees, maybe even 20 degrees cooler. So we're about halfway done with our trail and some dark clouds just moved in. Not sure if I'll get you those golden hour shots that I was intending, 
But it's only 5.30 right now, so we still have time. We'll keep pressing on. I can't get enough of this place. We're actually on the last trail. This is the Bison Trail, which goes to the Hudson Meng um, archeological site. But uh, I think I ran into some big cat tracks and uh, that's enough for me. I'm gonna turn back. I'm telling you, this place is otherworldly. I can't think of much to compare it to. Maybe Badlands in South Dakota, Teddy Roosevelt, North Dakota, but it's definitely one of a kind. What a super cool way to end the loop trail, up and over the mountain. So we're moving quick here. We got an electrical storm that just moved in. We're signing off. If you haven't done so yet, please subscribe to the channel. And remember, from Aglala Grasslands, Always room for you on every National Park adventure. Man, it is coming down. I got in the car just in time. I can barely see the road. I gotta get off this thing before it floods. So right now we're over the tracks. We got 12 miles on this road. I'm uh, a little concerned about this one. All is good.